It's fairy garden day, so let's make a fairy garden in a container. Beautiful sunny day out. Hello my friends, it's Sharon from Sherry's Fairies. And it's Fairy Garden Thursday. And I'm going to make a few fairy gardens. It's been a while. I bought these dish, these little dishes in Cranbrook. And I really thought they would make cute little fairy gardens. So I got the price tag off the bottom of this one. I got two more soaking. So we're gonna see what we can make. I don't like the thought of glue showing through. Maybe I should try some different glue. Not supposed to dry really clear. Alrighty. Now I've got this pretty napkins. Take one out. I'm going to mod podge the outside of the globe with this lovely napkin. So, I'm gonna separate it. I've showed you a dozen times, I'm sure. It's usually, there we go, there you got her. Okay, so we got the white back off, perfect. Now, I'd like to do this without too many wrinkles. I wonder if I should do it from the inside so it shows on the outside. Hmm. I'd like to welcome you all to my channel and at this time I would like to encourage you to please subscribe to my channel and if you like this content please give me a thumbs up and share this video with your friends if you like and say hello in my comments I like to know who's out there watching and it really helps my channel. I'm still got my goal for a thousand subscribers by the end of the year. And it's free to subscribe. So let's get back to making this fairy garden. Got the Mod Podge all put in there and the napkin. And I think it turns out rather pretty. And the reason I'm bothering with this is because I like the finish to be nice. And this is glass. So you don't want to see big gobs of glue when you put stuff in it. So, and I think that this is just, it'll be pretty. So it, we'll cover that stuff up. And this stuff all around here will just sand off or cut off or whatever works. And I like that, so I'm going to let that dry pretty good. It doesn't take too long. I could cut some of this off. Let's just cut this off. And then I can sand it good when it's all dry and get the glass edge showing again. And then I'll sand all of that stuff when it's dry so that we have a nice glass edge like that. Okay, well, that's good. Probably do something on the edges anyhow. So there's the little bowl. And this is what it looks like on this side. Stuff might still show through, but maybe not as much. Let's hope it looks clean. So now I have to kind of decide 
what we're going to do. I like moss. I'm going to put the moss in a basket of goodies. And I want to use this garbage. Put that in the garbage. And put this in the garbage too. Instead of making a mess all the time. This is pretty good. I am going to fill it with some moss. I'm going to put another glue stick in here. Moss all over. I'm just going to put nice moss in here. Make it nice and cushy. Nice and soft for our fairy to sit in. Well, it's looking good here, so that's good. That's why I wanted to put that there. Got that all stuck in there nice. And I'm going to use the little pink fairy to sit in here. And I have a little, where'd you go? And let's see, that's the fairy I'm going to use. She's in a pretty pink dress with braids. I thought she was pretty cute. And that's my husband making noise. Hopefully you can't hear it. Feeding the dogs. And then we have this little squirrel. And he's got a butterfly on his nose. And he's going to sit in here with the fairy. And I have... I bought these a long time ago, and I decided this would be the first best little dish of cookies. Now I'm gonna put, I'm gonna stick these guys in here because I know where I want them, and then I'm gonna decorate it up with some pretty flowers, and I think that'll turn out kind of cute. So let's put the fairy in first. Just put some glue on her. And hopefully she'll stick good in the moss. Won't wiggle around too much. And the little squirrel. With the butterfly on his nose. And the little dish of... Oops! The little... Oops! See the squirrel's falling over so we might have to... Stick him in there better. Okay, you gonna stay there? And the little plate of cookies. That'll be good. Right there. And I think that looks really cute. It's a different container. So now I'm going to take some of these flowers. I don't know how many. And I'm just going to glue them around here. I don't know if I'll do the whole thing or what. I might fill it all full of flowers. You never know. Let's see how they're going to stick on here. Hopefully they'll stick on there nice.
very maybe I need to set them up a little bit higher I think that's a good idea okay let's take these guys out of here I can leave the moss in there but I'm going to see if I can find something to put in there so I can hire them make them up bring them up a little higher and they'll show better and then I can put more moss just right around here. Let's just stick some moss right here so all that grass is, glass is covered up. You can always trim it off. And it's not too bad. Okay, where's my scissors? Okay, now I'm just going to trim this off so it looks tidier. <laughs> I know, I'm funny. I like things to look tidy. There, I like that better. And I definitely need to raise these guys up, so... Just going to have a look and see what I can find. Doing it? <laughs> Now, I have a piece of log. I'm going to set that in there, and then maybe I can just set the bunny and the fairy right on it. Or not the bunny. The squirrel and the fairy right on it. So, the log, I'm going to move the moss around. I'll get glue on it. Okay. And we're going to stick it down in there. There, that should be better. And they can have their picnic right on that log. Here's the little squirrel. There's the little squirrel. And I think that looks better. You can see him better. And... We'll sit the little fairy on the log, too. And they're just having a cute little talk. I don't know what that is, but I'm going to cut it out of there. Hopefully my tongue is not green. And... We have our little plate of cookies that we're going to put there. And the fairy and the little chipmunk are going to have cookies. There, that shows up much better. And I've got some glue here that I could pick off. Trim that. Pick off the glue. Now I just want to do something back here. See where all the flowers are? I don't like that. I think that looks messy. So I'm just going to put moss around there. Get a glue moss all around there and that'll clean that edge all up. So just need to get some moss out. And we'll start here. And we'll just stick some glue all along here. Get it quick before it drips down. And we're just going to add moss as an edge. And it finishes it, doesn't, and it doesn't look messy. Oops, it's my glue stick. Yes, I think it's turning out very pretty. I'm very pleased. I'm very pleased. Oh, that looks so much better than having the flowers sticking out. The flower stems and glue sticking out and looking messy. Yes. A little bit, a little bit right here. Need a little spot. 
moss right there. Our little fairy garden. And I think it looks really pretty. And let's show the back. The Mod Podge napkin, which shows through the globe, which I think is pretty. And the moss all around the edge with the flowers. And our little fairy having a picnic with a squirrel. And they've got their chocolate chip cookies. Well, there's our cute little fairy garden for this week. I'm sure they're enjoying those chocolate chip cookies. Sounds good to me. Well, I'd like to thank you all for watching this video. And I hope Grandma Sandy's okay. We still haven't heard anything. But this is a collaboration that she puts up every week. So, Grandma, hope you're around somewhere. Anyhow, our prayers are out to you. So, thank you again for watching. And there are many of us who do Fairy Garden Thursday. And you just have to put hashtag Fairy Garden Thursday. And all the other collaborators will show up in this collaboration. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in my next video, which will be Sunday Home Reset.